DAP Easy Installer plugin is now going to make DAP installation and upgrades even more easy and fun. Hello there, my name is Veena Prashant and in this video I'll take you behind the scenes to show you how you can use the DAP Easy Installer plugin to install and upgrade DAP with the click of a button. You can install the Easy Installer plugin like any other WordPress plugin. Log in to your members area on digitalaccesspass.com and under the additional download section, you will find the Easy Installer zip file. Download it to your desktop and if you have an older version of Easy Installer, which is less than version 2.0, make sure to delete that and uh, upload the latest version of Easy Installer and activate the plugin. Now, after you activate the Easy Installer plugin, you're going to find an option for DAP Easy Installer under WordPress Admin Settings. So click on that and it will bring up a page like this and you will have to enter your DAP license key, but you only have to do this once. If you have entered it already and saved it, then the next time you use the Easy Installer plugin, you don't have to re-enter it. It will be pre-populated. And you can get your DAP license key uh, from digitalaccesspass.com from your members area on that site. And again, you only have to do this once. Now, after you enter your license key and save it, it's going to open up this uh, area where you can see all the steps to uh, complete the DAP installation or DAP upgrade. First, I'll give you a quick overview of how Easy Installer works and the different steps, and then I'll walk you through each step in detail. Step one, Easy Installer checks your server to make sure that it meets the minimum requirement to run DAP. If any one of these PHP libraries are uh, missing or not configured correctly, you will see that it's going to report an error in red or a warning message in red, and you will have to work with your web host to correct that, and then you can proceed to step two. In step two, you can select the DAP zip file to which you want to upgrade, uh, final version or the beta version. Only the latest versions are uh, going to be displayed here. So select the version number and click on the one click install and upgrade to complete the DAP installation or the DAP upgrade. If you are upgrading from one version to another, the step is the same. You select the zip file and then click on the button. If you are looking to upgrade live links or you're looking to install live links, then just select the live links version number click on the one click install and upgrade button and it will complete the install or upgrade. And step four, you only need to do if it's a new installation, you don't have to do this for an existing installation. Um, and uh, basically follow the steps here to install the cron job in your web hosting cPanel. If you're already familiar with how easy installer works, then uh, you don't have to continue watching. The only thing that has changed is the one click installation and uh, before we just used to have this upload button so you had to manually download the file and then click on upload to upload the files to your server now you don't have to do that anymore you just select the version number from here from the drop down and just click on the one click installation or upgrade button to complete the installation or upgrade but if you are new to easy installer continue watching for more detailed instructions dap has two parts core dap and the live links plugin Easy Installer will allow you to install and upgrade both DAP as well as the Live Links plugin. Now let's take a look at how you can install or upgrade DAP. So in this drop down, you're going to find the latest DAP releases. Now, if we have a beta version out at that point, then you're going to also find the beta version. However, uh, if we don't have any beta version out at any given point in time, you will only find the final version. This is the final stable version of DAP and you can just select the version to which you want to upgrade. So for example, if you want to upgrade to this beta version, select that and then click on the DAP one click installation and it's going to automatically connect to our servers, get the zip file and upload it to your server. So you no longer have to do that part manually. Now, after the files are uploaded successfully, you're going to see this message that says success files have been uploaded and now you can proceed to step three. So you can click on step three to install the live links plugin. Now the one click install process, it works the same way for both new installations as well as upgrade. So if you don't have DAP yet and you are clicking on the one click install button to install it for the first time, it will just upload the files to your server. And if you already have DAP and you click on the same one click install button after selecting the version to which you want to upgrade, it will again upload the files to your server, but this time it will just replace your current version of DAP with the latest version. Similarly with Live Links, it's the exact same process. Select the version to which you want to upgrade, the final or the beta version. 
Usually the final version will go with the final version of DAP and the beta version will go with the final version, uh, the beta version of uh, DAP that's out at that point. So select the right version and then just click on the one click install upgrade button and uh, it will upload the live links files and installation and upgrade. They both work the same way. Uh, in both cases, the files are uploaded to your server. To upgrade live links, select the version number from the drop down and then you can click on the one click install upgrade button and uh, after the process is complete it's going to give you an option to activate the plugin now if it's an existing dap installation you don't have to activate live links because it will already be active so if it's an existing installation after you upload the live links zip file just click on this digital access pass link uh, in your wordpress admin and it will complete the upgrade and if it's a new installation then click here it will take you to the plugins page and uh, you can activate live links there. Now DAP Easy Installer just uh, is an easy way to upload the files to your server. You still have to activate the plugin. So as I said before, if it's a new installation, activate the live links plugin in your uh, WordPress admin plugins page. And when you activate the plugin, that's when the installation is completed. If it's an existing installation and you are just upgrading DAP from one version to another, then after you upload the files using the easy installer plugin, click on the digital access pass link and uh, that's when the upgrade process is completed. Now, if it's a new DAP installation, you also need to complete step four, where you need to log into your web hosting cPanel and install the DAP hourly cron job. And you can just copy the cron command from here and just follow these steps to install the cron job. And if you're not sure how to do this, you can always open a support ticket with us and we'll help you out with that. And uh, if it's an existing installation, you can ignore step four. You don't have to reinstall the cron job. This is only required if it's not already set up. If it's set up once, it does not uh, change from one release to another. So you don't have to update the cron installation if it's already there. So to summarize, download the easy installer plugin from your members area on our site. And then after you install it, you can access it from your settings page. Step one, it checks to make sure your server meets the minimum requirement to run DAP. And if there are any problems, it's going to let you know what the problem is and uh, you can work with your web host to resolve it. Then step two will allow you to upload the DAP zip file. You can select the version number to which you want to upgrade and then click on the one click upgrade button to complete the upgrade. Step three, it will let you install the live link zip file. Again, select the version number to which you want to upgrade. Click on the one click uh, button to complete the upgrade. And step four is only required if it's a new installation. You don't have to reinstall the cron if it's already there. So for an existing installation, you can ignore step four and you only have to do it for new installation. As you can see, the DAP Easy Installer plugin makes DAP installation and upgrades really easy and effortless. My name is Veena Prashant. Thanks for watching.